down on the street, WRX and Evo. video. I recently had the unfortunate privilege to be in New York for 48 hours. My work required me there and I had about 7-8 hours to spare to do a little bit of sightseeing. So naturally I took a hike through Central Park, walked around Ground Zero, visited the Gawker office, saw Wall Street and Brooklyn Bridge and walked the High Line. I was also determined to visit Soho, Little Italy and Chinatown as well. And for those who don't know Lower Manhattan like I did before I came there, there's a street crossing of Canal Street and Lafayette Street that separates Soho, Little Italy and Chinatown from each other. Cross either one and you will be in a whole different world. I had been on the watch for interesting cars the whole day but I didn't expect to encounter both a second generation WRX STI and a Mitsubishi Lancer on my hike from Soho through Chinatown to Little Italy. Both drivers had Asian backgrounds so I reckon they both were from Chinatown. The Bug Eye Subaru appeared to be a bone stock STI, while the Lancer clearly is a racing inspired cosmetic enhancement with the Evo 10 in mind. It had some carbon enhancements on the bonnet, rear spoiler, and some canards to ensure that it made its way through New York traffic as quickly as possible. Speaking about traffic, my experience of the New York traffic was that it sucked. It took my airport shuttle more than an hour to reach my hotel, even though there was no traffic at all. And surely there in the midst of Soho was a huge traffic jam. After I spotted the Lancer for the very first time, I ate some hipster lunch in Howard Street. I went hipster shopping in Howard Street as well. And this took about 40 minutes of my time. So I was really surprised to find the Lancer only managed to move from Lafayette to Church Street. That's about 500 meters or 0.3 miles. Yes, I found out that you really, really need a car in New York City.